down through here if you want to, and I'd like to scrub it sometimes. Look, see that? Get that old technique in there. Go right down through there and scrub that in. Okay. Moving right along. Maybe there's some little frozen bushes right over here. I'm just pushing up, loaded a little bit of the blue in that brush. Notice how it's a little darker than that one, so I want it to stand out. There's a little, little bit more down in here. See that? We'll put some rocks and stuff in there in a second. I'll show you. Just kind of getting ahead of myself, I guess, but sometimes it's fun to do that. Let's leave that down. All right. A few stones and things. I'm going to take my filbert brush. Load it with a dark on one side, light on the other side. Right in here, there's some stones in there, look, all kinds of little, little rocks. By double loading it, you put the light on the top, see it? So, dark on one side, snow on the other side. When you come in there, you just, you know, just kind of give it a little twirl. You put these stones on. Up through there. So it wasn't more that way. So that it shows up better. We go in here and put all kinds of little things. There's a big stone. Put them all up. You group them up. Now remember, don't just separate them like. I'm kind of doing now. I'm putting, going back, grouping some together because they, they lay together a lot of times in the streams. They're not separated like that. That's my idea. So, put a little bit of, got a little bit more of that black on there. It's picking up better. Lay that down and get the palette knife out. And I'm just going to push up some. Well, let's do the. I'm just going to pull down on it here. And let's go in here and put some water on it. Maybe there's some frozen ice sickles and stuff right in there. See that? Just lay them in there. Cut in some water, individual water lines underneath those rocks. So let's do the small laser now. This with this light blue. Look, you can go right here and just cut them in. See it? The more you put, the more you got to do. Of course, just cut them in like that, but keep them level. Keep them level. It's kind of a trick to it. And there, I just set some down in the down in the mud in the water. Not in the water. No, water, whatever. Grab a little bit more of this. I'll take some of this. Okay, right there. Just look where you want to put them and put them right underneath those rocks. See that? And it just instantly gives your rocks up after laying flat. Go right up in here and just kind of. Yeah, you can put in a little water. Maybe the current's coming down through there a little bit. Just make it look like something's 